Hey, what's up, Internet? This is Dark Roller 1030 here, and I am back from L.A. Um, it was a great week. I stood there longer than I expected, but it was great. I, You know, the plane trip was good. It was just one seat. Um, for Like, I had a whole road to myself there and back. It was a free plane ride. Um, I got there in like an hour and 40 minutes. It wasn't that big of a deal. Um, so it was so cool. I'm like, Pikachu misses me, so she's like rubbing against my legs right now. Anyways, um, I went to LA. Reason being is because I did, wanted to meet my uh, brother. We've been prolonging this trip for three years, and finally we decided to do it. Um... So I met him, we went to different places. The videos that I took for LA, I only have like stuff from Rodeo Drive, some Beverly Hills places, but I didn't actually have any really good footage. It was too shaky. So I have more pictures than I have of anything else. Um, so I will be putting that in, I think, tomorrow's video. And you guys will actually see the pictures um, of L.A. <laughs> uh, so on the first day of L.A., I went and I did... Um, my brother had a sh has a show, and it's called Jackpot. And the show Jackpot, he basically plays a guy who wins a lottery ticket and loses it. So he's doing one-man show where he's doing all the characters. He plays a mom, he plays a main character, he plays a doctor... He plays a girl at a convenience store. He plays a preacher. And it's just, it's so funny. It was so hilarious. And I thought he did an amazing job. And I'd like to thank them. So I'd like to thank you both for, you know, for having me come over. It was so cool. And then the next day was kind of like a Beverly Hills trip um, and Bel Air trip. So we went to Bel Air and we went to Beverly Hills. And then that was that. Then the third day, we went on Sunset Boulevard. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, Sunset Boulevard, I think, I believe we went. And we went up and down the street. I mean, we, we, we were looking at, like, you know, like the gay clubs and the gay bars. We didn't go in any of them, but we saw Gay Town and how crazy, you know, the gay town was, you know, because you're seeing billboards of, like, guys kissing and things like that so it kind of blows your mind that this is that <laughs> that this is there and all the stuff like that and that it's kind of like a normal thing and you see all these gay people out there and you just feel like so accepted in LA it was just it was amazing I didn't have to be afraid to be myself um and then on Friday um I went to <laughs> my brother and me were hanging out we were just hanging out for a day. He was trying to do a surprise for me. Um, Wicked was playing at the uh, at the theater, so he wanted to send me to the. Uh, he wanted. He said that he was going to buy me a ticket to go see Wicked, but they were doing a lottery, and whoever wins can win up to two tickets, sitting in the front row, watching Wicked that night. So I go and I'm doing. Um, I go and I, uh, we have to wait till 5.30. So we decided to take the train, go to the arcade, and we played for the arcade and killed like an hour and a half. Went back on the train, came back, and then we saw like a whole sea of people waiting outside. There was 26 seats available, but since each person can get two tickets, there was basically 13 people that they could call. Um... So they were calling names one by one. We signed our names. Me and my brother, only one person could do one ticket at a time. Me and my brother, we put up the tickets. <laughs> we put our tickets in there, and I was so freaking amazed. Oh, my God, I was so amazed. They called each name, and finally gets to my name. And when it gets to my name, they said, William Sosa. And I was just sitting there like, like, I was in shock. My brother's, like, jumping up and down. He's like, you won. He's like, you won. He's like, oh, my God, you won. And I'm like, I look at him, I'm like, ah, ah. It's 
so we kept jumping up and down, and we, we were screaming because I just won tickets to front row. I didn't know where in front row I was sitting, um, but for the show. So we got two tickets, so we went to his job, which was at the Kodak Theater. I went to the Chinese Theater and everything like that, so we went there. We went, we, uh, we ate food for free. We got drinks, um, like soda for me, because I don't drink alcoholic beverages. We were so excited. We just kept talking about how excited we were. So we go and we're just walking back and forth. We're taking, um, we're taking a bus. No, we decided to take the train because the show didn't start until two hours. So we were just like looking around stores and stuff like that. And then we go back to the train to go to Wicked and I found out that I was front row center <laughs> so I'm in front row center watching Wicked and I'm just like looking up and you see the orchestra pit and, I, and I'm looking up and I'm freaking amazed at like because you see like this curtain it's the map of Oz and it has the Emerald City in the middle and it's like lit and green and the show was amazing. It was fantastic. I saw Defying Gravity and like all the smoke is coming into your eyes and you're seeing her rise in the air and you're like, oh my God. And she's singing the high note and freaking everything just goes into black and oh, and everybody's clapping. I'm like, damn, that is amazing. I was, I was, I was really shocked. By the time I got to the end, I cried. But we were about to go outside. We go outside. Um, we were about to go outside. But my brother's like, why don't we just take this exit back here? Because people were going out there. Apparently, that's where the actors were coming out of. <laughs> so I got everybody's autograph. I also got a button, which is in the bag, but Mike is sleeping now, where it says, I won the Wicked Lottery. So I'll probably wear it tomorrow on my video. So I'm very excited because <laughs> I got to meet Elphaba. I got to meet the Good Witch Gl Glenda. I got to meet the Wizard of Oz. I got to meet the sister. I got to meet one of the flying monkeys and Fiero. So I met I met those people. They're all so nice. Oh, Fiero is so cute. Oh my god. Sorry. But, um, now I'm part of a whole bunch of different channels again, um, and so if you guys are interested in it, uh, I'm now part of a channel called Coming Out Gays, and my video game channel will be starting, I'm hoping next week, I have to get in touch with everybody to see if they can even do next week. And, uh, yeah, life without internet kind of sucked, or kind of having internet, very slow internet, it kind of sucked because... You know, there was times where I was, you know, where nothing was happening, so I was just, internet would have passed the time. I mean, I did have access to the internet for a little bit. I was able to chat with people, have things that were going on, and now SOPA had a blackout day, and um, Mega Upload got shut down, which I'm very upset about, and a few other things. So now... I come home to a bunch of surprises and it's just a lot of drama filled and I don't want this video to go longer than what it has to be but this is going to count as yesterday and today's video because I couldn't do yesterday's because I had to go to sleep early and I completely forgot but I did but you know this is going to count as today and yesterday's video but anyways guys peace out I love you